Okay guys, so I've finished cutting and portioning up all of my pasta. As you can see, it's all in its nice little bowls there. Um, I've just got a pot of water on that's come up to the boil with a little bit of salt, just a pinch, just to season the water for the pasta. So now I'm just gonna chuck it in. One of the biggest differences between cooking fresh pasta as opposed to uh, store-bought pasta is the amount of time it takes to cook. Store-bought pasta will take anywhere between 10 to 12 minutes. Fresh pasta will take about one to three minutes. So it's very fast. So you really need to keep an eye on it. Okay, while that's ticking away, we have our pesto alla Genovese, which we made yesterday. Smells amazing. Get that into a pan. And the pan's already warm. The pan's warm, yeah, I've just preheated it a little bit. Just like that. Beautiful. Alright. Turn that heat up a little bit. So your traditional fettuccine with pesto alla Genovese is literally just your pasta and your sauce, um, but you can add whatever you want to it. Us personally, Cora likes a little bit of bocconcini, just have some baby bocconcini here. I like peas in mine, so we're going to do a bit of both. Alright. So it's been about a minute. And that's getting pretty close. You want to cook your pasta to al dente. Um, basically, what that means is to the bite, um, which means that when you bite it, it should have a little bit of a little bit of firmness to it still. It shouldn't be completely soft. Basically, that's what that means. So that's about a minute off. Our sauce is coming up nicely. And once the pasta is cooked, it's just a matter of putting all of these ingredients together, tossing it about. Alright, so that's looking nice and done. So we're just going to strain it off. <laughs> Look, our stove is still rowing from the bubble ganache. <laughs> mm. Alright. Get your pasta straight back into your pan because you want a little bit of that pasta water to be in there as well. Smells so good. Beautiful. All right, chucking our peas. Some of our baby bocconcini. Is it bocconcini or bocconcini? Bocconcini. I've been saying it wrong for so long. On the top. 
toaster. All right, now we're ready to plate up. Some of those peas out, some of the bocconcini. This looks like so chefy for some reason. It does, but it's so simple. I mean, like, like the plating, plating from the pan. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Nice bit of freshly cracked pepper. Bit of grated parmesan. As much or as little as you would like. Clean up the plate a little bit. Chefy styles. <laughs> And just a nice little sprig of basil for garnish. And there you have it guys. Fettuccine with pesto alla Genovese. Bone apple tea. Yeah.